I am going to discuss on common characteristics and sexual dimorphism of short tail. Short tails are lovely and popular freshwater species of aquarium. Due to their beauty and low maintenance, these fishes make great choice for beginner. They belong to order Cyprinodontiformis and family Poecilidae. The size of the short tail may be quite large. Males may grow up to 11 centimeter, while the females are about 12 centimeter, excluding their tail length. And the lifespan near about three to five years. This fish body is elongated and flattened from sides. The feature of the fish is its unusual tail in a shape just like a sword, which actually gave the name to it short tail fish. The tail may be either rounded with one ray or it may have several rays. The dorsal fin rays number 11 to 14. The anal fin rays number 8 to 10, and there is no anal spine. Mid lateral stripes may be dusky or brownish or red color. Two additional red stripes may be present above the mid lateral line and one beneath. For the fish coloring, it is difficult to just one pattern. Though red with black tail seems to be the most spread one. And it is quite complicated task to describe all the species since uh, there is a large variety of its hybrid, such as koi hybrid, such as pineapple hybrid, such as neon short tail. And the wild short tail has a olive green body with green or red or brownish stripes along the lateral lines of the sides. They can also have speckles on the dorsal fin and sometimes on the caudal fin. And short tail are usually peaceful. Lively fish that swim in loosely grouped schools and they are generally considered a good community fish. These are light bearing fishes that breeds readily in the home aquarium without special attention if they are well fed and cared for. In fact, they can quickly overpopulate an aquarium to breed short tails, little more is required than to introduce both sexes in the aquarium. Although they usually attain sexual maturity at about eight to 12 months, and the average lifespan of the species is three to five years. They are omnivores. They feed on variety of invertebrates, insects, plant matters, and algal matters. The females are usually larger and they're reaching up to 16 centimeters in length. Whereas the males are sometimes smaller, sometimes smaller. And the length up to 14 centimeters. And short tail uh, males are slimmer in comparison to females. And they have a sort on the caudal fin, that is a tail fin. And this is the characteristic features, and that's so a peculiar feature. And due to presence of subtle structure, they show majestic behavior. And like other light bearing fishes, the anal fin of the male fish that is modified into tube like structure that is a gonopodium. Whereas the female fish that has a wide and fanciped anal fin. Females have a rounded tail fin and the female bodies are also more rounded and fuller structure. That is a di sexual dimorphism in between male and female sort tail. 
And what are the significance of the Sokel? It is a very popular freshwater aquarium fishes. And its maintenance cost is very low. And Sokel bred into various hybrid forms for the aquarium hobby due to its hardness and suitability for community tanks. So they are the make great choice for beginners. And they also used extensively in genetic and medical research as a model organism. These are the reference books, Ornamental Fish Farming, Shoyanatal, Concept of Aquarium Peacekeeping, S. Saha, Home Aquarium and Ornamental Fish Culture, Joyashree. And the image that are presented in my talk, captured from Google image, Thank you, everybody.